Get off the road! All right. I spent three weeks road tripping around Nova Scotia, New Brunswick, and Prince Edward Island, the three provinces that make up Maritime Canada. During that time, I saw dozens of lighthouses. And while there are hundreds of Maritime Canada lighthouses throughout the three provinces, and while I only visited a couple of dozen, these are my five favorites. First off is Cape George Lighthouse in Nova Scotia. Many of the lighthouses I came across in Maritime Canada were close to the shore. And what I really liked about Cape George was the winding road leading up to the lighthouse and its dramatic position high up on a cliff overlooking the sea below. The views from Cape George are extraordinary, and it was also quite peaceful with only a handful of people there when I visited. There are benches, picnic tables, and a grassy knoll, making this one of my favorite Maritime Canada lighthouses. Next was the Swallowtail Light Station on Grand Maman Island in New Brunswick. The approach to Swallowtail Light Station sets the scene for great anticipation. A steep set of stairs takes you down to a bridge that crosses what appears to be an isthmus. The walk toward the lighthouse is over rocky terrain with some grass and a few sparse trees. Nearing the beacon, the trail is exchanged for a wooden bridge or boardwalk that leads right up to one of the most photographed lighthouses in all of New Brunswick. The wonderful panoramic view of coastline coupled with the historic significance makes Swallowtail Light Station one of the best Maritime Canada lighthouses. My next favorite was the Prim Point Lighthouse on Prince Edward Island. The cylinder-shaped lighthouse and its stunning setting make the Prim Point Lighthouse my favorite on Prince Edward Island. With a large football-sized grass park surrounding the lighthouse, it is an easy place to spend a couple of hours taking in the scenery. And right next door is the Prim Point Chowder House, a wonderful gastro restaurant with outdoor seating at the edge of the shore with views of the lighthouse. Cape Tryon Lighthouse is next on the list. Not the prettiest of the bunch, but what made Cape Tryon special is its obscure and remote location on Prince Edward Island. A rugged dirt road leads to the sea where this weather-beaten lighthouse still stands proud. There was not a soul in sight when I was there, and the trails surrounding this lighthouse that meander down to the water make it a really cool place to explore. I assume this lighthouse is not viewed by many tourists as it is out of sight and surrounded by farmland. Last but certainly not least is probably the most famous and most popular of the Maritime Canada lighthouses. Peggy's Cove Lighthouse is set against a sensational setting. The idyllic village is utterly charming and the photographic opportunities are boundless. From the lighthouse itself, to a bagpiper playing in a Scottish kilt, to the fishing vessels in the harbor, Peggy's Cove looks like a village straight out of a storybook where countless scenes have been put to canvas and placed into history. Well, that's a look at my five favorite lighthouses in Maritime Canada. If you have a favorite, please leave a comment below. And until next time, we'll see you on the road. MicroTrip.com